So AI loves JSON. It's like really the, it understands it like the back of its you know, hand. And when you are sending JSON as extract from Salesforce, and if let's say you are extracting account and cases and case command and opportunities uh, and opportunity product distributions and all of those things, like three, four level JSONs, lots of records, it's very important that you actually send the record IDs, the 18 digit Salesforce IDs, and also send the parent ID. So if you are at the case or case comment level, then at the case comment level, send the parent ID of the case. And when you start sending those, you again realize that sometimes your prompts become more trustworthy because then they start to always give you better results. You can almost guarantee that they will give you a result. And again, I was not doing that because I was trying to be a, someone used the term as token conscious business analyst. So I was very token conscious and I was like, you know what? I want to write prompts and send information, which is absolutely important. And therefore I was not sending IDs. But then I realized that sending IDs is actually very beneficial. So I would encourage, recommend that if you are writing JSON prompts and sending JSON, that you must send uh, the record IDs, the 18-digit IDs, and also the parent IDs.